Hello, everyone, and peace of Christ to all, all of you. Please uh, take a note that uh, for some time we are going to do broadcast using this account, not the Arabian Prophet. Just take a note. Uh, and this is a short video. So today we will do a video at 4.30 p.m. mostly, as usual. But uh, this is a short video to inform you and to make a comment about uh, Trump uh, comments. You know, we hear the news today about uh, Trump is uh, going to bomb Syria, etc. Uh, if we read the tweet in front of us, it says, uh, Trump, he said, uh, uh, Russia vows to shoot down any missiles fired at Syria. Get ready, Russia. I mean, this is this is not this is not a smart statement from somebody. He is a president of USA. This is very stupid statement. And you know, I am I'm a person who voted for Trump and next election I have to vote for him because we don't have other choice. Otherwise, we will get a Democrat who is going to even damage the country even more. Uh Russia is not the one anyone want to play with, and we don't want to go in Russia in war because that will destroy all the world, not only America and Russia. So it's a stupid statement. I mean, he is just as making his threat directly to Russia. How stupid that is. Get ready, Russia, because they will be coming nice and new and smart. I mean, how in the world you say such a thing? That is that is a childish talk. This is not a talk of a, someone he is a president. You should not be partner with the gas killing animal who kills his people and enjoy it. First of all, all this gas thing is a fabrication, and I'm sure Trump he know it. But let me let me tell you what's happening in America. In America. We have people who have a problem and always they try to import their problems overseas. This is exactly what the scumbag Billy Clinton did when he attacked Serbia, not because he want to defend anyone, but because he is trying to take the attention away from his scandals. And now Trump is doing the same thing. He's trying to make us believe he is going to attack Russia and we know that he will never dare he might shoot some balloons in, in Syria, but not even close to the Russian But the problem is he is trying to cover something else. There is something behind the scene We do not know the FBI the right his office and obviously there is something very important Otherwise, they will never dare to write an office of a lawyer first. He's a lawyer. He have, he have immunity secondly, he is a lawyer of the president and there's no way they will do that unless there is something wrong. And look here. Much of bad blood with Russia is caused by fake and corrupt Russia investigation. So you see here the concentration. He is the, There is a contact together, like they go together, you know. He have a problem. He's trying to make us and to make you believe he have nothing to do with the Russian. He is not a friend for them. And now I'm going to hit them. Here we go. Don't you see what I'm going to do? I'm going to do that against the Russian. This is a, this is a dirty, stupid game and a very dangerous one. So there is something behind the scene we do not know. His war is false, is stupid. You know, where, where was Trump when the, the Muslim he is defending right now, the Muslim terrorists specifically, they were shall, you know, shelling and bombing the Christians area in Damascus. Every few days, the Christians in Damascus, they lose 10, 20, 12. Where, why come, how come Trump and Australia and England and the president of France did not bomb the terrorists in there? For bombing the Christians, even churches, for slaughtering, they kidnap seven thousand civilians. Those, the one who Trump is trying to say to you, he is going to protect them, and calling the Assad an animal. I am against the Assad, but he is ten times better than his friends. At least he is not killing Christians. So where was Trump when they were killing and slaughtering? Where was Trump and his gang, the the, the Western government, who they are in the, in the bed with the Saudi? And the Qatari, the money. This is money. When seven thousand were kidnapped, actually, just yesterday they released them. The terrorists they forced them to release seven thousand prisoners. All of them they are women and children. You believe it? So all of this game is a dirty game, just to cover their scandals. He have six scandals. He have it's it's exactly the same as Billy Clinton. It's looked like the destiny of this country 
and the Western country that you will never find a good person to have a trust in him he they launch word like now if he is going to bomb supposedly he is against the killing of the asset how many people you will kill with those, with those smart nice missiles mr. Trump I mean supposedly you are the good guy you are going to beat who exactly and you know what look look at the hypocrisy the Saudi they bomb children they kill children's women in Yemen we don't bomb the Saudi we sell them weapon he just signed a deal of more than a 100 billion dollar and the Saudi they are bombing Yemen for the last three years and go and check how many civilians get killed uh, the Saudi are our friends and we are making money from them so if you pay us you know you can kill you have a license to kill and what the difference between using chemical weapon or bomb like as if you are saying to me oh you know what it's it's not lawful to kill you by uh, by chemical weapon only by bullets killing is killing you idiot hypocrisy is stupidity and you cannot fool us with those propaganda thing and I believe all this thing is just a stupid thing is just to make a fog and cloud around his you know his his problems trying to take the attention the same as Bill Clinton he did always in the West they do those things to take attention the same as Sarkozy the corrupt man who was taking money from Al-Qazafi but yet he attacked Al-Qazafi and he is the one who killed him he killed him because he don't want he trying to cover his scandal how much how, how many million dollars he took from al Qazafi? so take a note please uh, for some time we are going to broadcast in this account and that I update you about the other account then we can go back to the Arabian profit I want to keep this one running and you know because it have many, a lot of subscribers but most of people do not know really that uh, like uh, I, I want to keep both or actually I have more than two so uh, uh, tell your friends that we are going to do podcast in the Christian Prince account for some time and then we can go back to the Arabian prophet after that thank you very much and may the Lord bless you and see you at 4 30 today again take care and see you soon bye bye